Hey, what's going on, guys? Uh, today I have a skirmish game on Vertigo, and I'm using the multi-tool after hearing that it will be brought to year two. Um, other guns that are be being brought to year two, No Land Beyond, which was a, uh, a needed thing, Dragon's Breath, Super Good Advice, just to name a, th a few, Plan C, blah, blah, blah. And I'm sure there's going to be more. And there's also armor pieces, but I'm not sure what those are. But if you want to see them, go check out Bungie's Instagram. Yeah. So, what do I think Destiny will be like after this December patch comes out? I think, well, they're nerfing shotguns into the ground. No one is going to, no, those things are not going to be touched. They're making them so they have, this, like, complete shit range. There's not going to be any reason to use them. It's going to be so underpowered. It's, it's pointless. Snipers. Snipers are still going to be good. They're going to be the best secondary you can possibly use because they, they're not nerfing aim assist or anything like that. Uh, Hammer is still going to be overpowered as crap because they're not nerfing that at all unless they haven't said anything about it yet. Um, fusion rifles. Now, I have some good fusion rifles like that. Uh, the Banshee one with Rangefinder. The Trials one is really good also. But fusion rifles aren't that horrible right now. But people just, you know, shotguns are way better and snipers are also better. So nobody touches them. But after this patch, fusion rifles are going to make a comeback, I think. Uh, pulse rifles, oh my god. They are, they screwed up with pulse rifles. They're, they're going to be so bad. It's going to be such a joke. Like, like Hawksaw, no one is going to ever use that again. Unless it's as a joke. It's just going to be so underpowered and it's not going to do any damage. Uh, auto rifles, I think, will be very good in, after the patch. And I I think I'll enjoy that because I haven't really had a chance to play with auto rifles when they're good. So this will be my first time, so I'm excited for that. Hand cannons are the worst gun type of gun you can use right now they nerf them so bad no one touched them and that's what's going to happen with pulse rifles but yeah but i'm glad because they're fixed they're uh they're patching hawk moon so the it's way easier to hit your shots while adsing um and they're just making it easier to hit shots while aiming down sights anyway so that's good i'm excited for that also and so i can use my last word in hawk moon Maybe pull out the thorn. We'll see. But, okay, so, uh, scout rifles. I don't think they're doing anything too drastic with scout rifles. But some of this, like, minor multi-tool, I'm excited to use that in year two. In trials, that's going to be f so much fun. Like, in this game, like, mine is, mine is amazing. It's really good. Especially with the sniper, it's really good. Okay, whatever, I'm getting off topic. Sidearms. I don't know what they don't understand. Sidearms need more range if they if they can compete with shotguns, because right now they cannot compete at all, especially with conspiracy theory. But they have potential to be much better. If you hit your headshots, like they're really good, but it's hard to hit headshots. You have to be really accurate. But yeah, sidearms have the potential to be good, but they're just not quite there. Um, Rocket launchers and machine guns still staying the same, blah, blah, blah. Still going to be annoying. Um, but, yeah, and they're getting rid of luck in the chamber f for uh, body shots, which is the best thing of all, because that is the most annoying thing. Like, after year one, every, they're like, yes, they're nerfing final rounds, so it's not going to be as obnoxious as it was before. And then, you know, a few weeks into the Taken King, they're like, you know what? Screw you guys. We're going to give you a new one. And this one's better. has just better stats overall. More, uh, it has no, the Irene has no aim assist, but it's luck in the chamber. So you don't have to waste your ammo. You can just keep shooting. That should have been a collateral. But you can just keep shooting and then hope it'll be a body shot. But you, you still got to aim for the head. I know Irene is still a good gun. And a lot of people don't use it for the luck in the chamber. But that's primarily what it's used for. So yeah, we'll see what happens with that gun. If it, no one it uses it, or if it continues to be used, we'll see. But uh, yeah. So, uh, what haven't I talked about yet? Mm, hand cannons, we did. Pulse rifles, we did. Auto rifles, we did. Scout rifles. 
Uh, yeah, and I think bringing all these year one exotics into year two is a an act of desperation because right now like Destiny's so dry and a lot of people have just stopped playing it for like Black Ops Three and Fallout Four. But you know, I still play this. So I don't feel like buying those, but this is their attempt of bringing all those people back in bringing all the comp like competitive like uh, all the competitive players will use multi tool and by bringing that back they're all going to start playing again and which means people want to watch them and people will want to be like them and use it blah 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 so that's probably why they're doing these guns no land beyond is you know everyone loves that gun so you either love it or you just hate it so much i love it it's one of my favorite guns but yeah um, super good advice. Not sure why they're doing that. Maybe a lot of people didn't have it or get to try it out after they f switched the stuff. I don't know what they did to it. But, yeah. Dragon's Breath? Uh, no one is going to use that. That thing is horrible. I kind of want to see if it's better now after that 2.0 patch, but I don't think it's going to be better. It's still going to be Dragon's Breath. But, yeah. Um, I hope that later today maybe Bungie will show more exotics that they're going to release because the stuff they released right now is pretty pretty good actually I'm I'm happy with the things they selected to uh, bring to year two I'm sure they're just going to bring all of them to year two eventually probably they're just going to release them release it release it release it and until they're all out over the course of a few days you know but all right, so the uh, the pieces of armor, the bones of Ao, the Twilight Garrison, which I'm super excited for, just gonna make Titan even more broken, and the Acleophage Symbiote, Radiant Dance Machines, Apothis Veil, Peregrine Greaves, which will be fun, ATS Eight Tarantula, um, Nothing Manacles, the Armamentarium, which I'm also excited for, and yeah, there's also Hard Life for Primaries. Uh, tell me what you think. Destiny in December is going to be compared to what it is now. Drop a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you next time. Peace out.